Hi everyone, I am Tanmay. Appreciate you all for being here on a weekend morning. A very warm welcome from Udan Aviation Academy. I am here to set this masterclass in motion by introducing the young and dynamic subject matter expert for the day, Mr. Sai Santosh Thota. Sai, like you and me, is an aviation enthusiast at heart. And on a professional front, however, he works as a revenue management consultant at a leading mid Middle Eastern airline, which is Kuwait Airways. I would request Sai to straight away take this session from me. And everyone, since everyone is eagerly awaiting the session, let's uh, get this ahead. Thank you. Hi, good morning, everyone. Good morning, Tanmay. And uh, I should first of all thank uh, Udan Aviation Academy and Vash uh, especially for uh, making this happen today. So let's come across like what is uh, revenue management basically. Uh, revenue management basically uh, is required to maximize the whatever money which which the airline is getting in that has to be maximized. So how are you going to do that? So the main concept of revenue management is to maximize the whatever I mean the profitability by selling the the correct number of seats, the number of seats which you sell at various fair levels based on the demand which fluctuates in different different seasons or whatever it is, different timings and with the pricing elasticity. How are we going to manage the revenues? So first basic thing is the how do you plan your route? And how do you segment the market? And how do you predict that demand, passenger demand on different routes and uh, different uh, places? And how do you optimize the price when the demand is been fluctuating? And after optimizing the price, you got inventory management. How do you manage the inventory? And then recalibrate, recalibrate the whole thing by doing the, uh, like monitoring the performance of whatever we have done till now. So this is how the total process happens in an airline, um, I mean, for a revenue, uh, for maximizing its revenues. Uh, so the RM strategies are basically the uh, revenue maximization. So I've showed you different options which we have been uh, using through the RM systems and controlling the spillage and spoilage. Uh, so before three years for any airline it is like strategic planning has to be there so this basically starts before three years till one year before the operation start so it is a market research network development of the type of fleet you are planning for that route or those routes and next comes within one year it is a schedule you are supposed to the schedule uh, we are supposed to uh, file and the RBD structure and the control of the, the inventory which we are supposed to decide and the pricing structure which we are supposed to give on. And the tactical planning comes on when it is just 90 days before day of departure. Here, if you can see, say for example, I gave here four aircrafts for you. Okay. And uh, here, if you see the first aircraft rotation with the flight numbers are so and so, okay, and origin code, destination code, and departure time and arrival time, and the total total is the number of frequencies per day. I mean, sorry, per week. One, two, three, four, five, and seven is one starts with uh, Monday, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, and there is no Saturday frequency here for this particular flight, and the seventh is the Sunday. Okay, this you need to follow here. And uh, it's the same thing with the second aircraft and the third aircraft and the fourth aircraft also. The available seat kilometers are 326,244. <laughs> the ask. 44. Yes, yes. Yeah. The ask is 326,244. Yeah, yeah. okay. All I've done is that the cost of the flight, yeah. as per your calculation, is 50 minutes is nothing but 0.83. So 2.83 into 4. That makes it 11.32 lakhs. Mm -hmm. I've divided that with the available seat kilometers, which is 3.26 and it is 3.47 is the cost. Uh, yeah, that's right. You're right. Yeah. So what I 
believe is love is always in the air, but it is always in fair for me. So that's how it is. And uh, this is all about revenue management, uh, like whatever I have learned till now. So thank you so much for the opportunity, guys, and uh, patiently listening to me. Thank you.